Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we have the Bastet Transformation. I also have a tutorial coming for you this Saturday on how you can make a set of these cat ears yourself. All materials as always will be listed completely below. If you would like to see how to do this look on your own, go ahead and keep on watching. Hey guys, today we're going to be working with that damaged prosthetic that we built the edges up on in the previous tutorial. All materials will be listed below and I'll be attaching with the Ben Nye Clear Liquid Latex today. With the makeup sponge, apply a layer all over your face, everywhere where the edges of the pieces will lay, and along the outer edge of the prosthetic itself. I'll pop in my Raven Contacts, Primal Contact lenses were kind enough to gift to me, and they are linked below as well. Apply that nice even layer of that liquid latex to your face. Also add it to the edge of the prosthetic and allow both to fully dry. Place the piece down carefully as the latex will fully adhere to itself and spread outwards. Use a Q-tip to coat any more latex under any missed edges. Once dry, trim off any excess or rough edges and remove any latex from your face that may have chunked up in the movement. Build up a thick layer of the latex around the outside and over onto the piece. Try to blend it outwards thinner and thinner for a smoother transition. You can build up thin layers for a very seamless edge, but I'm not going to worry about that so much today since I am not going in public with this one and I am going to bed in about 30 minutes myself. Allow to completely dry and then be sure to powder everything completely with a translucent powder to set. Working with black body paint, cover your face and neck with a thick, even coating. I will be carrying mine down below my collarbones and onto my arms as I do have a large neck collar that I'm going to be accessorizing with that will cover up the rest. I do use a makeup sponge randomly as well to help even the layers around my eyes and any detail areas or deeper areas that need to be layered a little bit more. Try to get as close to your eye edges as you can, but do not put it onto your waterline. Now going back in with some gray, lightly cover the areas that you want to highlight as raised shapes and blend outward. I start with a little and build in layers towards the center of each highlight to have a softer transition. Once I'm happy with that, I set the darker areas with the black powder, and don't forget to also set your neck and your arms. For any areas that I need a darker or better transition, I will add more body paint and set while damp to deepen further. Going back in with a white powder, I set the highlighted areas starting at the centers and blending outwards. Be sure to blend everything into the black. Be sure to also bring that white down onto the neck on top of your muscle structures as well as your collarbones to help add some definition on the throat as well so it is not just flat black against everything. And align your waterline. Mm -hmm. 
Moving on to the details, I use a gold body paint to accent the eyes. For the top and bottom lids, I am leaving a very thick black line around my eyes so that they will pop a little bit more since I'm not adding lashes to this look. I built the gold liner into two layers to help intensify the gold against all of the black. For the face, I line the top edge of the nose as well as the seam down the center lip. I then carry the gold into little dots inside where whiskers might be. I'm choosing not to add actual whiskers to this look. I'm adding a wig, ears, and some teeth that I made as well as some jewelry and color accessories. I'm then adding black paint to my arms and hands and using finger extensions that I made quickly. You can use latex to hide the seams, but I won't worry about it. Thank you guys so very much for watching. I know that you have a massive selection of videos to choose from here on YouTube, and I'm so very grateful each and every time that you choose one of mine. See you later.